Hi there! Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you some of the basics in using J and L cut in DaVinci Resolve. Here we are in DaVinci Resolve and I have four clips here. First clip is this bird flying and the second clip is of my wife Arlene she's uh, crocheting and then getting up of the sofa and oh this is oops so loud this is me trying to play the drums and let's skip to the next clip here this one is me again on the laptop doing some heavy duty work okay so before I show you what J and L cut is let's put these clips in order first first I want to show you just a straight edit <laughs> So me playing the drums and let's edit right here. Okay, so this is a straight edit. Let's bring these two over here. And this one here. Working away, looking over. And see the bird flying. Okay, so that's... Straight edit. An L cut is you move your audio from your first clip to extend to the second clip. So for this one here, I'm just gonna hold down my Alt key on a PC or a Option key if you're using a Mac. And then you would just move your audio over like that. Okay, let's, uh, okay. So now, this is what you get. Because this is sort of like an L. So you have an L here, and that's why they call it an L cut, okay? A J cut is the opposite of the L. It is in the first video, you will start to hear the sound of the second video. So in this case, let me find the bird. And again, I'm just gonna hold down my option key or the alt key on a PC. And I move the audio forward like that. Okay, so now this is what you get. There, and because this is like a J, that's why they call this a J cut. That's your classic J and L cut. Okay, that's it for this video. I hope it will inspire you to also give J and L cut a try. 
in your next video. For those of you who haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do. And remember to click the bell so you'll be notified next time I upload a new video. That's it for now. Keep on filmmaking and have fun creating. See you next time.